Steam Boss video. Hope everyone's doing great today. We're getting really close to uh, all the holidays here in December. Hope y'all are having a good one. Today we have a strip and wax job at a restaurant. I know you guys love these, so we're gonna take you along today and film it. I don't know if you guys noticed, we got some new shirts over here at Steam Boss. Looking, looking pretty cool. So I really like them. Uh, let me know in the comment section below what you think about them. But without further ado, we are gonna load up uh, the floor machines and we are gonna head over to this restaurant. We have to move all the tables, stripping off all of the old finish, applying four coats of new finish. And I actually think we're doing a little bit of tiling grout there as well. So without further ado, let's load up and let's head over there. All right, so here we have the floor for today, guys. It's a really cool uh, checkered floor here. Um, we did this one last year. We did not film it. Um, it is pretty scratched up, you can see here. Any like any restaurant would be just from scooting the chairs back and forth and stuff like that. So they do a good job cleaning it, but it's definitely time to freshen this up, give her some shine back. You can see it doesn't really have too much shine on it anymore and a lot of scuff marks. So we have to move all of these chairs. We're gonna strip this thing, four coats of finish. It's gonna look good. Let's bring everything in and get started. Scrub the kitchen floor first. Check out that line just from doing that. So we just got to CRV that in. We're going to tile spin it, rinse it. Get all these chairs out of here. CRB made a huge difference on this thing, so now we're just extracting with a tile spinner. Low air pressure. You're not really gonna hurt this terrazzo, but it's definitely pretty dirty. But it's a kitchen, a lot of grease. What do you expect? <laughs> Get it. 
breaking her down real nice. You can see how pretty dirty it is here. But taking the dirt and the wax off looking pretty good. Doing the corners over there. Corners over there, sucking it up over here. Good. It was dirty, I'll tell you that. All right, so it's not looking too shabby. Oh man, it's definitely a little bit difficult because even with the guard on the machine, look how dirty that is, huh? Goofy, sloopy mess, but that's all right. Look how good it's looking over here. Sucking it up, mopping her. And then we will uh, rinse it at the end with the carpet truck to make sure it's nice and clean. But yeah, big difference uh, for sure. So after we do that, I'm kind of just spreading it around because it's drying up a little bit. And when it dries, it leaves footprints and marks. So kind of just going through it, re-agitating it while he uh, sucks it up there. So he's sucking that up. I literally just, uh, I just ate it right here. I was uh, laying the stuff down. It's super slippery right here. Stepped on the cord and uh, yeah, I fell. I did. Nobody caught it on camera though, but I did that. Gotta be careful on this stuff. <sighs> like it's so slippery. All right, so if you guys are wondering how to do VCT super efficiently, um, you can see here, I'm working with the machine. I'm working my way back at this point. Um, we have Spencer sucking up the uh, slurry, all the wax, stuff like that, and Trevor's back there uh, mopping right after him. And that's kind of the most efficient way to get this stuff done, especially when you're uh, in big open areas. It works really good, so I'm gonna keep working my way back. Those guys are gonna keep doing this. We will uh, rinse all of this with the truck mount at the end. Uh, you could also, if you don't have a truck mount, just mop it like three or four times, but um, we're gonna neutralize it, rinse it, and then uh, we'll be good to, after let it dry, lay some wax.
All right, so here is where we, where I should say we are at uh, before we clean it. All OX, I'm gonna take it off and you can see kind of what it looks like unfinished, not shiny at all. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and rinse this down, make sure that it's nice and clean for us to apply the finish. It will be good. Just finished coat number one. It'll get a lot duller than this. The first coat always absorbs uh, in the tile a lot, but after four, it's gonna look amazing. All right, end result for this one. Four coats, looking really, really nice. Way better, all those scratches, all the dirt's gone. Looking great. We're going to head on over back to the shop, unload this truck, and uh, that'll be it for today. All right, let's see what kind of water we got today in that floor. Ooh, pretty bad. That's restaurant floor. A lot of old wax. And all that kind of junk. Could be worse, but pretty bad. Is it chilly here in December? A cool like 59 degrees. I think we broke, I think we hit 70 today, but either way, got my jacket on. We are done for today. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. We don't do a ton of VCT, but when we do, I like to film it for you guys because I know you like to watch it. So without uh, further ado, we're gonna wrap it up here. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe if you are new. We really appreciate it. And as usual, we'll see all you on the next video. Peace.